Hey everybody, Derek here from Crew. I'm just giving you a quick update on the rooftop tent development. Thanks for following along. You've probably been following us either on Facebook or wherever it is. We, we really, really appreciate you following the project along and your input. So please feel free as we go along to offer your advice and your, your, your input and your suggestions. That's why we're doing this. Um, as you can see behind us, exciting times here. We've gotten our first prototype back from the factory. It's doing a hell of a lot of what we wanted to do. Um, we're not, obviously not quite there yet. There's still uh, a good bit that we need to iron out, but that's hey, that, that's part of the process. Um, you can see we have a customized cocoon uh, ready to go inside. Um, and if you're following crew for, for a little while, you'll know we focus primarily on two things in our design. Number one is modularity, so that you can use, use products together, use them by themselves, use them in different use cases, and insulation, obviously. So again, the crew rooftop tent is going to really double down on, on those two aspects. Number one, modularity, and number two, a nice insulated cocoon starting. We start our design typically on the inside and work out. So we want to make sure that you have a nice, peaceful um, time in the rooftop tent and, and in other crew products. So we've, we've decided we're going to take another step here. Um, a lot of the molds that are available for developing rooftop tents are kind of the same. If you're familiar with the industry, you'll know that a lot of the tents kind of follow the same design, the same functionality, that kind of stuff. Um, we don't really want to do that. We want to do something different, uh, our own design as it were. So we're going to open a new mold. Um, the downside of that is cost. It's going to cost more than $10,000, than $10, which is obviously um, quite an investment for a small company like us. But we think it's worth it. I think the product we'll end up with will be much more what we want and it'll be much more different um, than, than what's out there at the minute. And we're not here to talk down any other brands. There's lots of great rooftop tent brands out there at the moment doing what they do. We just want to do our thing so it'll be a little bit different. And we want the tent to work on the ground as well. We want it to plug in to other crew tents, as you know, so it'll fit in with the clan tents, it'll fit in with the cottage, extent all of those kind of um, the other products we want you to be able to maximize the use cases with all our products again like I said use them separately or use them together so even the cocoon you'll be able to take out of the rooftop tent and use it in other use cases too so to do all of that we quite simply have to open a whole new mold start from the scratch and work our way up uh, and we've given uh, the go ahead to go and do that so uh, that's kind of the next step um, we, and then once we have that done and the next prototype back will be a lot closer and we'll be able to show you a lot more detail. We're obviously working on IP and stuff like that in the background as well. So we don't want to give too much away at this point, but certainly by the end of the year, we'll be able to show you a lot more detail on the product. Um, the mold, the next iteration is supposed to be on its way to us before Christmas. So that's, that's the next step and that'll be very, very close to the finished product. So really looking forward to checking in with you then again, please continue to follow us along, sign up for the email updates. Um, follow us on YouTube, follow us on the Facebook page and because we'll, we'll, we do want to keep you involved in the conversation and you, the crew community, involved in the development of the process. We always do it and this is this is why we're doing this. You know, we, we want to get your feedback. We want to solve your problems. There's no point in developing something that we think is great but, you know, the community don't like it or don't use it or don't want it. We want to make sure we're solving a problem that you have and that's what we're doing here again with the rooftop tent and we'll have it ready for launch uh, by the 2nd of March. So, thanks for following along and we'll check in again soon.